Hi everyone! Merry Christmas! It is Mama Llama AG with of course another opening of something from American Girl. This is so cute. I love this front cover. Adorable with all the little puppies and one kitten here and the back of the catalog that they sent to me in the mail with my package. All the cute cozy PJs, so cute. I especially love this little um, robe there and then the pajamas. Oh, they're just so cute this season, I love them. So, I did get a few things and we'll get right into it. I did get, and I'm gonna reach over and grab my scissors here, something I've wanted for some of the outfits in A Christmas Story, if you know that movie, Ralphie in the bunny pajamas. And here's the coat. And this is really cute. Oh, wow, okay. So these are actual buttons. It's not Velcro. So very nicely done, very high quality, good job. American Girl has these cute little pockets down here. Um, and these pockets do open a little bit so they're not sealed shut and then you have the American Girl logo there and just the back this is a very very cute set so I know I think it was like $48 or something um, but it is nicely done I would recommend it if you decide to get it and splurge a little bit oh gracious these are so cute okay so these are her snowsuit suspenders, and they have um, the little loop on the bottom where she would get into it, put her little cute little feet here, and then put the boots on so her feet go in here to hold this closed in the, um, the little stirrups and hold them closed in the boot so the pants don't pop out of the boot and get socks wet. And these really cute suspenders that do come undone so you can put them on the doll um, no. they feel metal but almost look plastic I'm not really sure they do pop off very easily so just be mindful of that for ease of getting them on and off your doll but these are darling absolutely darling you have pleating in the front Okay. And then also comes with it. I'm going to take it out of the plastic bag. Okay, this is the plastic belt, and it is more of a teal, like a teal green, not a teal blue. And that goes around her coat to cinch everything together. And then just a pair of socks. And this is a cream color, almost like the color of eggnog, um, but this is her low turtleneck, and it just velcros in the back. And then, my favorite piece to this outfit, you can actually use this with other um, doll outfits, and not just this one, but I, oh wow, these are great. Um, these yellow wellies they are 
darling. They are so cute. And you can you can unattach them and take off the little um, fabric here, not fabric, but like the little bungee cord in a way. You can take that off to get that on your doll's foot um, easier if necessary. If you take them off, do not forget to put them back on right away because they add that perfect detail to the boots. So that is one outfit. And then, let's see, what else do we have in here? Oh, yes. I don't know if these are unavailable now or not. I might have gotten them just in time. The boys' festi festive formal outfit. I adore these. Again, suspenders. Totally into the suspenders, evidently, this season. American Girl. Very cute love this outfit and I love this outfit um, not only because obviously like you know it's great that the boys have a festive outfit but also this outfit is very um, universal this can be used for many different seasons I suppose so you have this white button-down shirt that could go with really any outfit boy or girl oh my gosh and these suspenders I mean look at these pants they are darling they are so cute so you have like these black or dark gray or black pants and these suspenders I mean they're fantastic and they're sewn into the outfit so you can't take the suspenders off and then just wear the pants separately um, but they do come unattached we have the connector here in the back adorable absolutely adorable and these shoes for the boys or anybody really you could put on your girl dolls are phenomenal these little penny loafers or loafers I should say they are extremely adorable and then oh my gosh okay so and then you just have some black socks with it but oh the suspenders and this bow tie is what really set this apart for me and really made me want to get this I mean this bow tie is like the cutest thing ever cutest thing ever it's adorable. This outfit actually um, doesn't have to necessarily be just for Christmas. I think this would be fantastic if you wanted to dress him up for Thanksgiving. So he could wear this for Thanksgiving all the way through to New Year's. Um, and then this does come with a nice little pamphlet inside the outfit and um, making this little star cookie so you have this nice little recipe on how to make this cookie and it's the boy and the girl outfit back here and I did get a few more things so I am going to keep these boxes lately I've not been keeping my American Girl doll boxes but because of the holiday um, and type of box that it is I think I will um, keep these because they're a little bit more collector so of course if I got the boy outfit I had to get had to get the de uh, dress part so the, for the girls. So this one is phenomenal. It has several layers. It's glitzy, it's glam, and again, I think you could have your girls wear this from Thanksgiving on through to New Year's. This is definitely New Year's dress material. And you do have the same pamphlet on the inside. You do have that. Doggy. My dog is like sniffing this. I don't want him to get at it. Oh, wow. This is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I love this dress. 
I love this dress. You have these soft tool layers with the glittery stars in them, and then it has an underlayment for the dress um, underneath. It is very soft. It's not stiff. It's not like hard glitter, or hard materials. Um, you have a magenta glittery bow, so it's gold glitter. Um, has some other colors in it, and the bow itself is magenta. You have some glitter on the bodice, and you have some tulle sleeves. So this is stunning. And then you have the coordinating August no um, coordinating headband. So this will go in your doll's head. Whoops, doll's head. Um, and then from there. She does have a glitter wristband, wrist bag here with a bow on it. Darling, so darling. And it's Velcro to open. And then she has these phenomenal ballet flats. They're so cute. And then they just attach right here. And it has a cute little bow in the back. That is so precious. Oh, I love it. So keeping along with the Christmas theme, I believe they might have done this a year previously, but I never had purchased it before. This is my first time purchasing this tiny little elf on the shelf. Um, my kids have... Um, been into Elf on the Shelf, we have a buddy and we have a candy sparkle, and they love their Elf on the Shelf when they come by every year. And this is so adorable, I can't even, I can't even. So, and then on the back, there's your little Elf on the Shelf there. And it opens up on the side, just like the real Elf on the Shelf does. Oh, she's so cute. She is so cute. Now, she does not come with anything else other than her. I just got this little one. That's all I had ordered. I think there's others in the past that come with other accessories. I did not get that. I just wanted to get this itty bitty teeny tiny little female elf on the shelf. She's so cute. She has this cute little skirt on with the snowflake. Um. So we have to take her out. She doesn't have a book or anything like the other elf on the shelf um, kid size comes with. And that's okay with me. I just couldn't resist. This year I had to get this one. And I am so glad that I did. I am so glad that I did. And then I have one more item in here. And when I was on the site, it said limited quantities. I don't know if they're just restocking or if they are rebranding this or if they're just getting rid of it all together. But it is Kaya's Trading Feast and Matt. Um, I don't have Kaya. She's on my wish list. So who knows when she might grace her presence at, at our house here. But this is so wonderful. Okay, so this is her basket with all of her trading items she'll put inside. It has some rope here, and then this is how she ties it or attaches it to her back. She slings it um, on her back and carries it with her. Also comes with, and this is plastic. Like an amber color plastic bowl. Put some items in there. And then we just have these faux pieces of greenery. So you have the faux greenery. And we can put that potentially, put that here in the bowl and I'm just doing this quickly so I don't have anything nicely done and then I'm not sure exactly what this is but another food item that into the bowl and then you have some 
some berries here to be blueberries here. And that can all go in. I think I'm just gonna throw these here in her basket. And we have a few more items. So another food item there. I don't know if that's necessarily squash. That's a little too small to be squash. I don't know if it's like a kind of melon or a kumquat or something. And then you have some other, you have four pieces of that item. Those are individually done. And then, I don't know if this is salmon or some kind of fish, if that's what it's meant to be. Um, but you do have three of these um, pieces individually. And you can tuck them all nicely into her trading basket. So all the pieces are nicely tucked away in there. And then the last item in here, she can lay everything out so nice and neatly on her trading mat. So this is almost like a bamboo style. So anyway, um, that is all that I received this year so far. <laughs> um, but thanks for joining me and next time we'll probably do an All My Dolls video. And I hope everyone has a Merry Christmas, Happy Holiday, Happy Hanukkah, Happy New Year, um, and just a very happy holiday.